Okay, okay, so we're here live from Tucson, and this gentleman brought me this amazing stone. Tell us what it is. Okay, this stone is from Bisbee, and what it is, is it is opalized Chris Cola, and it has been stabilized. So it's stabilized, so it's going to be harder. That's what he tells me. So I'm going to use the diamond wheels to grind this down. And so what he wants to do is he just wants to do a little area here and to show people what the stone will look like once it's polished. And that's what we're going to do. We're going to use, I don't know what I have under here, maybe the 250 flex diamond. We'll see. So let me grab my water tray right here. I see you can do this dry. So let's go ahead and grind this baby. That's pretty. So yeah, so we're cutting this down. So I just did the course enough. I'm gonna just jump to the medium, you guys. That is so pretty. I'm excited now. different rub action and then I drop it I don't slide it off the wheel but look at that you guys see that mm -hmm. already we're there honestly that is so pretty look at just that yeah. alone shows how beautiful it is oh, you see that so just, that's in two steps we just did nuts okay so that was the medium and look the medium has unfazed and again you guys I don't use brand new wheels so these wheels should last you a long time if done properly but if I was sliding off the wheel I'd be wearing off the edge makes sense makes sense physics Isn't it so pretty? 
Yeah. You see that? So, like the wanted, we just did a little area so the customers can see what it looks like. Doesn't it make a difference when you, like, when you kind of like open a little window into the stone? So that was done on the jewel tool using our lapidary. Basically, I used the stuff that are included in the soft stone kit. And we're here live from the Tucson Gem Show at the Casino del Sol Resort. Thanks for watching, you guys. All over the place.